Islamic State, is, has lost more than a quarter of its territory in Iraq since the U.S.-led coalition air campaign began in August, a Pentagon spokesman says. Colonel Steve Warren said it was too early to say the tide was turning, but that airstrikes and Iraqi ground forces had unquestionably inflicted some damage. It took over large swaths of northern and western Iraq last June. The announcement came ahead of talks between Iraq's Prime Minister and U.S. President Barack Obama in Washington. Iraqi PM Haider al-Abadi wants the coalition to step up its air campaign against his Syria unchanged. Colonel Warren told a news conference on Monday that it had lost 25% to 30% of its territory in Iraq, equating to 12, 950 to 15, 540 square km, 5, 000 to 6, 000 square miles. The front line had been pushed either west or south in the provinces of Erbil, Babil, Baghdad and Kirkuk, he said. Among other strategic infrastructure and sizable towns where is has lost territory are Mosul, Da'a, Zumar and the vicinity of Sinjar Mountain.